The state's largest school district is giving the green light to the budget for the upcoming school year, and they plan to increase spending at no additional cost to taxpayers. Let's check in now with 7 News' is Henry Coburn. He's live in Greenville with the new plan. Good morning, Henry. Good morning, Sabila. That new budget calls for $34 million more in spending than last year's budget did, and it comes at no extra cost to taxpayers like you said. It was passed last night unanimously by the Board of Trustees for the 2021-2022 school year. Now, the budget calls for 715, nearly 715, I should say, million dollars, and that's a big step up from the $680 million budget passed last year. The money includes funds for everything from most salaries to utilities and maintenance to instructional costs. New expenditures for the district include raises both for teachers and non-teaching staff, a boost to the salary of first-year teachers, money to hire on staff for the new Fountain Inn High School, and more. The district is axing some of the money spent on COVID-19 cleaning and disinfecting worth $1.5 million, but most of the extra dollars will come from increasing property values, added state funding, special revenue funds, and leftover money from budget years past. Now, the budget may be tweaked depending on funding from the state passed by House and Senate later next month, I should say. The board said in last night's meeting that it will revisit the budget to uh, adjust for those changes as needed. For now, we're live in Greenville. Henry Coburn, 7 News.